Hey, Betty Bash. It's the 11th of September. 9 11, 2018. And uh, this came to me last night. And I almost got out of bed to go come and make a video. <laughs> but I figured I would just get to it today, right? Well, <laughs> even more has been piled on to this giant ritual. Um, this right here is a show. I believe it may have been the first actual show in the new Oculus last year. Okay, And this thing opened up on the 23rd of June, 2017, when they brought Rome to New York. Michelangelo's Sistine Chapel. Now, this is just craziness. It's a ritual. I have no idea how these things play out until they do. And many times it's just a spiritual warfare ritual that they do to gain some sort of strength. A lot of the time it's just overt and you see it. A lot of the times it's not. We have no idea exactly what they conjured, if you will, uh, until it, you know, comes to fruition. But nonetheless, this is a giant ritual. And all the players, all the usual players, Elton John and all these people are all involved in it, whether they know it or not. Okay? So this Michelangelo Sistine Chapel was in the Oculus last year, June 23rd. If you're not familiar with what the the Sistine Chapel is, the Final Judgment, it is a mural in the Vatican, in the Sistine Chapel. Very famous mural. Okay, most people have seen this in their lifetime. They understand what it is, but they don't know that they're looking at the dragon. That they're actually staring down at the beast. Or should I say, he's staring down at you. That is what that is. And that is where all the cardinals go to pray when they have to vote in a new pope. Okay? See the, see the dragon? Because that's what it is. It is literally the beast. Okay? And he, see him there? I mean, you can't miss him. He was in the Oculus last year. Okay? And we could go through all the images and stuff if you want. But nonetheless, I just have to show you this. On, on the 23rd, that show opened up. And wouldn't you know that from that time to today, 9-11-2018, is exactly 444 days. Now, the 444 in the occult world is very, very powerful. You just, there's so much to this stuff that you don't want to get too, too deep into it. I'm just saying, is this is not something you... You need to dig into. You need Jesus is what you need. I mean, with him, all things are revealed. There's a peace within you. You are sealed and delivered. You, you have no fear in this stuff. Okay? So seek him first before you go digging into this dark world that is all around us. And there's only one escape. Jesus. So 444 days exactly. Now, I showed you that there was Elton John was playing, right, on the same uh, same night. Tonight he's playing there. But what I didn't know was uh, Jay-Z and Beyonce are also performing tonight in Arlington, Texas. Okay? Now, there's so much to this that I, I have to limit what I show you. So, I'm just trying to point out to you the underlying powers and principalities that have been at this stuff forever. And now we are able to see it. And once we shine the light on it, light has entered your world. And you can see and understand your Savior that, that Jesus is the only way. Okay? But anyway, they're on their OTR2 tour. Okay? OTR. We can just go right down the line here. First of all, Jay-Z. Uh, thinks he's Jesus, and they think that this woman is the mother goddess, and that their twins, okay, are going to, let's say, repopulate the world in a new theology, uh, a new religion, 
to their god. Satan. OTR2. They love their numerology. They live by it. O six T two. There's your twenty six. The R nine. There's your nine eleven. Twenty six nine eleven. This is just what I see, you guys. I can't help it. And uh, this again, like I say, this goes on and on and on and on. <laughs> it's so unbelievable the depths of these things that it's it does it defies words sometimes I can't help it but there you go four four days and Jay-Z had just made a record now get this this record 444 was released the exact same week as this was in the oculus where today they will experience a symbolic way of light you see what I mean? So, <laughs> this is just what I see. And I'm compelled to share it with you. Don't forget, yes, Jesus is 444. But so is Lucifer. Okay? Okay? Just, just remember that stuff. Because this is a two-way thing. It's a spiritual war. Good and evil. Of course the devil's going to mock Jesus, mock God, and just fool the world uh he's the he's an expert at it he's the best he's good but he ain't better than jesus when you got jesus when you're indwelling the holy spirit this stuff it, it to me this is cartoonish how foolish these people are to think that they can that they are actually going to have victory in this this craziness but there they are in texas and and trump is at the tower Marking 17 years since September 11th, okay, at the Tower of Voices. I'm just telling you guys, this is the craziest stuff. And uh, I haven't even, check this out, let's do this. My, uh, my Google Earth has been acting kind of wonky, but we need to check this, okay. I started to do this last night, but I just couldn't, I couldn't do it, I was too tired. But uh, I marked out Arlington, Texas, where they're going to have this uh, this concert with Jay-Z. Jesus and Mother Goddess are going to be here in Texas, right? And now, <laughs> we, we're going to go to the Oculus. And I want you to just keep in mind that, you know, these things that, that I show you, uh, they're real. I mean, I show them to you, but what exactly they mean can be a, a wide variety of things. Now you see how my Google Earth is not acting properly here? I don't really know why. But, uh, here we are. We're at the Oculus right here. I mean, just look at the, look at the dimensions of this. I mean, how can you make this stuff up? A blatant 911, a 1388, three, and 8 or 11, 8 and 1 or 9, 0.44, okay, <laughs> at exactly 60 degrees. And that plays out in this as well. This is just the kind of stuff I see. I, I really can't explain most of it. I mean, this literally came to me as I'm like finishing dinner, getting ready to go to bed. I'm like tired. And I'm like, wait a minute, I got to check this out. And I remember this. I did a video or two about this last year. And, and, and the fact that it's exactly, you know, seriously, 444 days, exactly. And that Jay-Z and his 44 are doing their OTR2 26 11 And I showed you all the 26s. I mean, this is just the kind of stuff that, you know, you can't deny because it's right in front of your face, but to fully understand it is another story. Just know, <laughs> just know that there is a huge spiritual war just raging all around you. And this is merely the light being shown on it, watching it manifest into this natural world. And if you're not aware of it, and if you're not sealed under the blood of Jesus... Uh, it will devour you. It will snare you. It will trap you. It will trick you. And it will devour you. So just seek Jesus. And this is all kind of almost like uh, 
like watching TV, the equivalent of watching TV. It's, it's excitement at every turn, the things that God shows us. And I just don't know how else to put it. You need Jesus, you need Jesus, you need Jesus. That's all. Uh, really. Uh, it's all I have for you. So, you know, Trump's at the tower today. Jay-Z and Beyonce are at the uh, Arlington Stadium there. 1,388 miles away from the Oculus. Where they had the beast, the dragon, in their first show 444 days ago. And today, they're having their symbolic way of light moment at 1028. You see where I'm coming from? So, you know, I just share this stuff because it's worthy of sharing. And again, just, you can look into this stuff, but if you don't know Jesus, I would suggest you seek him out first. And then these things will make complete sense to you. Because you can get lost in this stuff. It can be dangerous. It's very alluring. Once you start to see how it all comes together, if you're not in Christ, you're going into a dangerous place. So just bear that in mind. And seek Him, first, foremost, and always. Okay? The 444, the Jay-Z thing. Because these people truly believe that they are gods in the sense of little g do what thou wilt they serve another master in fact they serve 444 lucifer you see how he mocks god and jesus constantly constantly that's who they serve that's what 444 is in jay-z's world in beyonce and their twins okay so, I had to show you this stuff, because that's just what we do, right? Uh, this is a, a ritual. It could result in something very overt and very explosive. And it also could result in a very covert ritual that merely conjures power for them to carry out their dark and dastardly plans. This is how, it's magic. It's all sorcery and magic. To fool the people. To not seeking God. Okay? So that's what you want to do. Today. This morning. Whatever you're doing. You can pray in your heart no matter where you are or what you're doing. You can do it. Trust me, I know. I do it daily. All the time. So, I guess that's it for now. Um, just keep looking up, people. Keep prayed up. That's all I can say. An armor up, big time. Full armor today. Full armor always. And seek Jesus diligently. Peace and grace to y'all. Any fish. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore take unto you the whole armor of God, 